Hey guys, I am here with a Hatchimal surprise. <laughs> so I've only ever opened one Hatchimal before on my channel and it was a Draggle and it ended up being the green one and his name is Reptar, but he cannot be here with us today. But today we are going to be hatching him a friend. This is the Birtle, so we can either get the purple Birtle or the blue Birtle and I really, 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 really want this blue Birtle. This is the Walmart exclusive Hatchimal and they have been extremely hard to find, but now they are starting to appear on the shelves, which is really fun. So, Hatchimals, you should know what they are by now after all the Christmas hype, but you have to take care of the egg and then he'll hatch out and then you get to play with him. But I'm gonna get this out of the box first and then we'll, we'll talk about it a little bit more. Okay guys, I got the little Hatchimal out and he's falling asleep and we're just gonna push him back that way. So, looks like a little bit of the packaging has changed a little bit since I last opened one, unless this is just was in the Birdle one. But we have this big giant thick instruction booklet. Um, YouTube.com slash Hatchimals guys. Let's go ahead and turn it into here. Okay. So it shows you how to hatch this egg. There's an introduction. So stage one will be the egg. Stage two will be the hatch hatching. Stage three is the baby. Stage four is the toddler. Stage five is the kit. So you nurture the egg for stage one. You have to keep rubbing it, warming it up, showing it attention. And I think within 20 minutes, I believe it is, it should start hatching. 20 minutes of care. Um, it doesn't have to, it's continuous care. So if you're sitting there rubbing it for 20 minutes, it'll hatch around that time. Um, 20 minutes isn't a set time either, so it could happen at any time. I think my draggle started hatching like f 10 minutes into it. Um, so if you have to leave or go do something, it won't do anything. So obviously right now it is just sleeping. It's not going to try to hatch at all or anything. So the next stage will be the hatching where it will start hatching and pecking its way out and you have to keep nurturing it same same way as you would to get it to hatch to get it to hatch and then once it's out it's the baby and then you gotta gotta care for it because it's gonna have different colored eyes going on let's see right here right here's the English we have the colored eyes of the light lights of the eyes and what they mean so let's see, for instance, blue, light blue, it's cold. He's cold, so you have to rub his head or squeeze his belly. Um, and it just it shows you what you can do in any of these situations, which is really nice. I don't know what's the, on the inside of this one. Is this just a bunch of different languages? I think it is. Wow, this comes in every single language imaginable. That's nice. And let's see, before hatching, uh, hatch, yeah, it says right here, hatching will take up to 20 to 25 minutes total. You can nur uh, nurture your egg continuously or over time. So you could take the, a week to hatch it if you wanted to. Um, right here, the top, right there's the bottom. Rainbow lights appear when they're ready to hatch. And then there'll be like a little da -da 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 song. <laughs> You'll hear it. And let me see if there's anything else we need to know before we get started. And then here's just all the information on playing with it. And I think that's super fun how they have all that there. So let's bring our little guy back in and see, I just woke him up. So you just gotta keep like, if you peck or tap the egg, he'll tap back. He did before. There you go. I think he's done playing. <laughs> so you can keep the egg warm. You just gotta keep doing this until he starts to hatch. But I love the little pattern of the egg, how it has like this splattered on it. It has the blue and the purple, the colors that the little guy could possibly be. But like I said, I am really hoping for the blue. I think that's just such a cute color. Oh, he's so excited. You can tilt him and <laughs> And you can usually see, I'm gonna turn off the lights for you guys. You can kind of see the lights of his eyes. There's his eyes. So nice. There you go. Ready to come out yet? There you go. That's his hear my heartbeat. 
You can kind of hear the heartbeat. Nice. Okay. So, while the egg is hatching, um, it says, don't worry, can't hatch without you there, like I just said. Um, rub the bottom of my egg to encourage me to start pecking. My egg will flash white light when I am pecking. When I stop pecking, my egg will start flashing rainbow lights. Rub the bottom of my egg to, to encourage me to keep pecking. When I've pecked away enough of my egg and you're ready to pull me out, wait until I stop pecking and you see rainbow lights. Remove the top of my egg and break away any extra pieces in the shell that might block my way. When the way is clear, pull me out of the egg. You will need to pull quite hard and you will hear a loud click when I am pulled out. Remove the plastic around my wings, throw out any remaining parts, and press my belly and you're ready to play. So I'm going to go ahead and just take care of the egg and then when he starts hatching, I will come back. Got hatching people, I think. He did the rainbow thing. There, shh, there, he started. Okay, where do I, where's the next one? There. There. These are so cool, there. I don't know where he went in that time. Is that him right there? Right there? Ooh, that's the best one. Come on, don't stop, little guy. Did he stop? I think he... He's going to... Don't, shh. It's okay, shh. Are you gonna hatch? Come on. Come on. There, oh, you guys saw an action shot right there.
Okay guys, our Hatchimal is pretty much done hatching. It just has these little, like, little two bits here, but we're just gonna take them out. So it's safe to say, really quickly into the hatching, we found out this was a purple one, which is okay. It's okay. Okay, I gotta get this little, this little girl out. Come on. Oh, there we go. So she's out. I gotta clip her plastic off. Let's see here. Maybe. Her fur is just in the way. I think I clipped her fur, my bad. Let's try it again. There we go, we got it. I have a big giant mess here of eggshell and stuff, but here she is. Oh, her little twisty. Isn't that twisty, but that's okay. So, here she is. She has a little turtle shell. She's like a butterfly and a turtle mixed together. If, that's, if you haven't, you didn't know that. So she is has butterfly wings, butterfly antennas, and a turtle shell on the back. So let's see. Play with her. She should move around. I think. Yep. <laughs> okay, now you can see her light. Her eyes are lit up. So she currently has yellow lights on, which is just a neutral, like, she's cool. She's fine. Now, let's see if her eyes will change at any point here. We'll move her shell away back here. Come on, you can do it. Oh, she's blue, so does that mean she, is it? Okay, she's good now. So again, let's bring this paper, sorry. Let's bring this paper back in. It's what color their eyes are, what it means, and what you should do. So, she's yellow. So she's just, she's chill, she's chill. Um, so a few things, she is in the first, well not the first stage, but she is in stage number two, which is, or stage number three, sorry. Um, she's the baby. So, that means, if you feed her, you tilt her forward and you can feed her. She's blue, so she needs her tummy rubbed. She is scared. Um, you can pet her head when she's scared. I thought it was light blue. When she is light blue, that means she's cold. She needs her tummy rubbed. Oh, like right now. Okay. There we go. Back to normal. Um, what's another thing? You can tilt them upside down. And you hear him say, "We oh, she's purple, which means she's hungry. Okay, she's eating. And if you squeeze her belly tickle, or repeatedly, you're tickling her. And then, if she's ever sick, um... Oh, you t when she's sick, when she's green, her eyes are green, that means she's sick. You pet her head to comfort her. Um, scared, when she's scared, the dark blue, you could, of course, pet her head or you could make a loud noise. And then when her eyes are orange, that means she has the hiccups, so you should clap to scare away the hiccups. I want her to go to stage four toddler before we end the video because I want her to talk. I, that's my favorite part about these guys. Um, you press their button, say something, and then they repeat it, which is really cute. Oh, there's her hiccups. Yeah, we got it. I really like this one. I like the love the turtle shell. I love the the combination of this. I've I've been thinking about getting the Target exclusive, which is a parakeet. It's a bear and a parakeet. Let me know. Definitely let me know if you guys want to see me do a video on the Target ex exclusive if I ever find it. There you go. Back to normal. And let's see what else. I think that's pretty much all you need to know. We just got to keep her happy and 
Um, eventually she'll age up, she'll, the rainbow lights will flash and she'll make that nice little sound. <laughs> um, let's see, she's purple, it's purple, she's hungry. She good? Oh, she's good. Um, she keeps coming towards me. Uh oh, you're hungry. <laughs> Good. And they're super soft too. Very, very soft. Impressively soft. And then the wings are just plastic. I kind of wish the wings were soft as well. I think that would have made it like a hundred times better. But that's okay. Oh, you're cold. My bad. I don't know if your belly. Are you scared? What does that mean? I forget. <laughs> Gotta rub your head. There we go. Come on! <laughs> she's either facing that way or she's walking too close to the camera. So just as an FYI, when they do reach the toddler stage, like I said, you could teach them how to talk. Or you can make them learn to walk, um, there's a dance mode, and then when they get to stage five, they can do silly sounds, tag, Hatchimal says, and psychic Hatchimal, so they do games, four games. Oh, you're hungry. And then there's just a whole little, I'll show you, whole chart for the games. But we won't get that far in this in this video. I just want to let you guys know really quick. Um, it's really easy to actually turn these off. Of course, if you leave them alone, they'll go off and go to sleep. But if you want to shut them completely off, there is an on-off switch right here, and I just hit it so they are completely off. Okay, guys. I don't think we're going to get to the toddler stage today in this video. So, I'm going to end the video here, but when she does turn into a toddler, it's really, really awesome because you just press her belly, say something, and then she'll say it back, which is really fun. But, definitely let me know if you guys want to see more Hatchimals. Um, I know the whole, whole excitement of it is over, but I think these are still super cute. But, let me know. Also, let me know what you think of this one. This little girl, she's so cute. I love the Birdle species. Definitely my favorite so far. I've only ever opened the Draggle, but so far this is my favorite. But let me know. Also make sure you give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!